Imagine holding in your hand a gemstone older than the continents, older than the dinosaurs, older even than most of the Earth itself. A gem that has witnessed the birth of oceans, the rise of mountains, and the shaping of our very world. Sounds like science fiction, right? But this isn't fantasy, it's zircon. Zircon isn't just a sparkling stone you might see in jewelry. It's a tiny time capsule that contains secrets from over 4.4 billion years ago. That's right, zircon is considered the oldest known mineral on Earth, predating nearly everything else we know. In this video, we're diving deep into what makes zircon so special, why scientists treasure it more than diamonds in some cases, and how these crystals can tell us stories about the dawn of our planet. Let's explore, right here, on History of Simple Things. Let's start with the basics. Zircon is a naturally occurring mineral. Its chemical name is zirconium silicate. It forms in igneous rocks, often as small crystals, and is prized for its brilliant clarity and rainbow flashes of color when cut. But don't confuse it with cubic zirconia, the man-made diamond substitute. That stuff's lab-grown. Real zircon is 100% natural and, in some cases, incomprehensibly old. Zircon comes in a variety of colors. Golden, red, green, brown, and even colorless. But the real magic lies in the trace elements locked inside. Those tiny inclusions, especially uranium and thorium, act like internal clocks that can be read using radiometric dating. So, how old are we talking exactly? Well, the oldest zircons ever discovered were found in the Jack Hills of Western Australia. These tiny crystals have been dated to 4.4 billion years ago. Considering the Earth itself is around 4.54 billion years old, that's practically the beginning of time as far as our planet is concerned. These zircons have become geological celebrities. They are the closest physical evidence we have of Earth's earliest crust. And by studying them, scientists are piecing together what Earth might have looked like when it was still cooling from a molten state. Think about that. These crystals formed when Earth was just a baby, still being bombarded by asteroids and covered in volcanic chaos, and yet they survived all that. That alone is pretty mind-blowing. So, how does zircon work as a time capsule? Here's where science gets really cool. When zircon forms, it naturally incorporates uranium atoms into its crystal structure. Over time, those uranium atoms decay into lead at a steady, predictable rate. Scientists use this radioactive decay, called uranium lead dating, to figure out exactly how old a zircon is. Because zircon is incredibly stable and resistant to heat and chemical changes, it holds on to this radioactive record without much disturbance. Even if the rock it's in gets melted or altered, the zircon can stay intact, preserving its ancient history inside. It's like geological black box technology, surviving every catastrophe and still telling the story. So, what kinds of secrets has zircon spilled? A lot, actually. Those Jack Hill zircons have helped scientists conclude that Earth may have cooled and formed a solid crust much earlier than we once thought. Some even contain signs that liquid water may have existed on the surface around 4.3 billion years ago. That challenges old beliefs that Earth was a hellish fireball for its first billion years. And if water was around that early, it raises big questions about when life might have started. Maybe life didn't take as long to emerge as we thought. Maybe it began in the shadows of volcanoes or in primitive oceans not long after Earth solidified. Thanks to Zircon, the timeline of Earth's early evolution is being rewritten, and it's a far more fascinating and possibly habitable story than we ever imagined. Now, Zircon might not have the prestige of diamonds in the jewelry world, but don't let that fool you. 
It has its own sparkle, especially when properly cut. And in terms of scientific value, zircon is arguably more precious than any diamond. While diamonds are often no older than a few hundred million years, zircon's billions of years make it invaluable to researchers. Diamonds may be forever, but zircon is from forever. Interestingly, some zircon gems are even used as alternatives to diamonds because of their brilliance and fire. But their scientific value means many of the oldest ones never make it into rings. They're kept safely in laboratories, carefully analyzed for clues about our planet's past. Zircon isn't rare, but ancient zircon is. Most commercial zircon is mined in countries like Australia, Sri Lanka, South Africa, and even the United States. But only a tiny fraction of that is old enough to be of serious scientific interest. Besides Jack Hills, ancient zircons have been found in Canada and Greenland as well, contributing to a global puzzle of Earth's earliest crustal evolution. And because zircon can survive so much geologic trauma, it's often found in sedimentary rocks, washed down from older sources, just waiting to be picked up and analyzed. That makes it a powerful tool not just for dating rocks, but for tracing where they came from in deep time. Outside of science and geology, Zircon also has a role in folklore and mysticism. In some cultures, it's considered a grounding stone, believed to help with spiritual balance, wisdom, and emotional strength. Ancient people may not have known it was billions of years old, but they certainly felt something powerful about it. In Hindu tradition, Zircon is associated with the planet Venus and thought to bring wealth and charm. Meanwhile, in the West, some confuse zircon with December's birthstone, blue topaz, or with cubic zirconia, but true zircon holds its own legacy. Even if you're not into geology or gem lore, there's something humbling about wearing a piece of Earth's first crust around your neck or on your finger. To think that something so small and often overlooked could carry the weight of billions of years that's what makes Zircon so extraordinary. It's not just a gemstone. It's a messenger from the ancient past, quietly holding on to Earth's deepest secrets. So the next time you see a glittering gem, maybe ask, how old is it really? If it's Zircon, the answer might just blow your mind. Thank you for watching. If you have suggestions for our next video, feel free to share them in the comments below. We'll be sure to give you an acknowledgement for your contribution. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the history of simple things. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more stories woven through the smallest details.